What's up everyone? This is Bullshot, back again with the most anticipated Call of Duty mobile video of the season. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. So in today's video, I am going to be covering the top 10 best guns to use inside of the Season 8 Battle Royale update. I am going to be ranking these 10 highly recommended weapons based on their time to kill and their overall versatility on the battlefield. And I am going to be showcasing you the best custom gunsmith setups you can get your hands on and their most recommended mods to use inside of the Battle Royale. Now, if this is your first time here in my channel, then be sure to press the subscribe button and make sure to turn on the post notifications. And please make sure to hit the like button below as this helps me a lot to make contents like this for you. Anyways, with that being said, let's get right into the video. Starting at number 10 spot, we have the DLQ-33, which is renowned for its high damage output, especially effective in long-range engagements. It can take down enemies with a single shot to the upper body or the head, making it a formidable choice for snipers. It typically has a slower rate of fire compared to other weapons, but its high damage compensates for that. The DLQ-33 is ideal for players who prefer a sniper role in the Battle Royale mode offering high damage and excellent range, but requiring careful aim and strategy due to its slow rate of fire and reload time. Here is the best custom gunsmith loadout of this bolt-action sniper rifle, which is equipped with the signature magazine attachment. It is a pretty well-rounded custom sniper rifle that can give you guaranteed knockouts in the Battle Royale. For the mods with the DLQ-33, I am recommending you to use the Sniper Extended Magazine mods, the Fast ADS mods, and the Sniper Expert mods to get the most effective results possible. Then, coming at number 9 spot, we have the Jack 12, which is a powerful shotgun known for its high rate of fire and significant damage output. This shotgun that excels in close quarters engagements, making it particularly effective in tight spaces or when you need to quickly clear out enemies at close range. It has a rapid rate of fire compared to other shotguns, allowing you to deliver multiple shots quickly. It delivers strong damage per shot, making it lethal at close range. The damage can vary depending on the attachments you use and the range of the shot. Here is the best custom gunsmith build of this weapon, where I have improved the overall range of damage and increased the ammunition capacity by a pretty significant amount. And this will certainly give you the maximum potential of this weapon. Anyways, for the mods with this automatic shotgun, I am recommending you to use the long barrel mods for the shotguns, the fast DS mods, and the long range mods to get the most effective results possible. Then, coming at number 8 spot, we have the M4, which is a versatile assault rifle known for its well-rounded stats and adaptability. This assault rifle has a relatively high fire rate, which allows it to be effective in both close and medium range engagements. It offers good accuracy, making it reliable for precision shooting. Its recoil is manageable, especially with the right attachments. While not the highest damaging assault rifle in the game, its damage output is sufficient for most situations. It performs well in sustained fire due to its balanced stats. Here is the best custom gunsmith build for the M4, which is highly compatible for mid-range engagements. It is a suppressed loadout, with pretty much zero recoil issue, and this build comes with the classic red dot sight as well. For the mods with this assault rifle, I am recommending you to use the extended magazine mods, the long range mods, and the precise shot mods to get the best results possible. Then, coming at number 7 spot, we have the Fennec, which is a compact and highly effective submachine gun known for its speed and close quarters prowess. The Fennec boasts an exceptionally high fire rate, which makes it incredibly lethal in close range engagements. Its rapid firing capability allows players to quickly dispatch enemies in tight spaces. While it excels in close-range accuracy, the Fenex accuracy can be less effective at longer ranges due to its rapid fire and smaller magazine size. This makes it ideal for aggressive playstyles. The Fenex delivers solid damage output, but its effectiveness is often most noticeable in close quarters where its high rate of fire can overwhelm opponents. Anyways, for the custom loadout of this weapon, I am using the Extended Magazine A, which is super important attachment for this loadout. This extra ammunition capacity will be extremely helpful inside of the Battle Royale. 
For the mods with this one, I am recommending you to use the hip fire boost mods, the long range mods, the extended magazine mods to get the best results possible. Now, coming at number 6 spot, we have the Krig 6, which is a well-rounded assault rifle that stands out for its balance between damage, accuracy, and range. It has a moderate fire rate compared to other assault rifles. It's not the fastest firing weapon, but it maintains a good balance between speed and control. This rifle is known for its excellent accuracy, making it effective for medium to long-range engagements. Its recoil is relatively low, allowing players to maintain better control and precision during sustained fire. The Krig 6 offers a decent balance of mobility. It's not as agile as submachine guns, but provides enough maneuverability for most combat situations. Here is the best custom gunsmith build for the Krig 6, which is highly compatible for mid-range engagements. It is a high-performance loadout, with pretty much zero recoil issue, and the overall accuracy of this build is pretty compact as well. For the mods with the Krig 6, I am recommending you to use the extended magazine mods, the long-range mods, and the precise shot mods to get the nest results possible. Then, coming at number 5 spot, we have the Bruin MK9, which is a powerful light machine gun that stands out for its high damage output and sustained fire capabilities. It has a relatively high fire rate for an LMG, which allows it to deliver a lot of bullets quickly. This makes it effective for suppressing enemies and maintaining pressure in prolonged engagements. The accuracy of this weapon is good, and its stability helps in maintaining a consistent spread of bullets, making it effective at medium to long ranges. The weapon performs well at medium to long ranges thanks to its high accuracy and damage. Here is the best custom gunsmith build of this powerful light machine gun. This loadout is highly optimized for mid to long range battles. It provides you with great overall accuracy, amazing damage range, and improved recoil management, which makes this build more compatible than its ground variant. For the mods with the Bruin MK9, I am recommending you to use the vertical recoil control mods, the precise shot mods, and the fast ADS mods to get the best results possible. Then, coming at number 4 spot, we have the Grau 556, which is a highly versatile and popular assault rifle known for its balance of performance characteristics. It has a moderate fire rate. It's not the fastest firing assault rifle, but its rate of fire is well balanced, providing a good mix of speed and control. One of its standout features is its excellent accuracy. It is particularly effective at medium to long ranges due to its low recoil and stable shooting pattern, which helps maintain precision over extended periods. This weapon delivers solid damage per shot, making it effective in various combat situations. While not the highest damaging assault rifle, its reliable damage output is complemented by its accuracy and control. Here is the best custom gunsmith build of this mid-range assault rifle. This loadout is highly compatible to use inside of this season's Battle Royale. For the mods with this assault rifle, I am recommending you to use the vertical recoil control mods, the extended magazine mods, and the precise shot mods to get the best results possible. And now, coming at number 3 spot, we have the PPSH-41, which is renowned for its exceptionally high fire rate. This allows it to unleash a rapid stream of bullets, making it extremely effective in close quarters engagements, where a quick and sustained fire is crucial. This weapon's accuracy is decent at close range, but can be less reliable at medium to long distances due to its high rate of fire. Its recoil can be challenging to manage without the right attachments, which can impact precision over longer ranges. It delivers strong damage per shot, particularly in close range encounters. Its high fire rate compensates for its somewhat lower per shot damage, enabling it to quickly overwhelm enemies in tight spaces. Here is the best custom gunsmith of the PPSH-41, which is highly optimized for close range battles. It has great hip fire accuracy, decent damage range, and improved mobility. For the mods with this one, I am recommending you to use the hip fire boost mods, the long range mods, and the extended magazine mods to get the best results possible. Then, coming at number 2 spot, we have the Type 19, which features a high fire rate for an assault rifle, which enables it to deliver a rapid stream of bullets. This makes it highly effective for sustained fire and suppressing enemies over extended engagements. The accuracy of the Type 19 is generally good, particularly when used with attachments that enhance its stability. 
It performs well at medium to long ranges, due to its manageable recoil and consistent shot spread. This weapon delivers strong damage per shot, which, combined with its high fire rate, makes it a formidable weapon in various combat situations. Its damage output is well suited for dealing significant damage in both short bursts and sustained fire. Here is the best custom gunsmith build for this weapon, which is highly compatible for medium to long range engagements. For the mods with the Type 19, I am recommending you to use the Extended Magazine mods, the Long Range mods, and the Vertical Recoil Control mods to get the best results possible. And finally, coming at number one spot, we have the BP-50, which is known for its strong damage output and versatility in both close and medium range engagements. It offers a good balance between damage and accuracy, making it effective for various combat scenarios. The BP-50 has almost identical rate of fire as the AK-117. It doesn't shoot as quickly as some submachine guns, but its balanced fire rate helps maintain accuracy while delivering consistent damage. This assault rifle boasts excellent accuracy, especially when equipped with appropriate attachments. Its recoil is manageable, allowing for precise shots even at longer distances. It typically has a standard magazine size for assault rifles, allowing for sustained fire during engagements. Here is the best custom gunsmith build for the BP-50, which is highly compatible for medium to long range engagements. For the mods with the BP-50, I am recommending you to use the extended magazine mods, the long range mods, and the vertical recoil control mods to get the best results possible.